Hi, I'm going to show you how to make a mirror for your doll and you will need a foam plate. Uh, it doesn't matter what size it is. Or you can use a bottle cap for a smaller version. Sorry, my thing's adjusting. But yeah, so you can use that and um, needed for it, you will need foam. See, um, uh, some paint. I'm using Tula Slick fabric paint. I'm using black. You could also use duct tape, but I think I'm gonna go with the one. So you will need some tin foil. Optional stuff to decorate with, like ribbon. Okay, so start off by cutting out the foam plate the way you want. I already cut mine out without a tracer. I cut mine pretty good. It's like a, a perfect circle. And then, here, let me get a different colored one so you can see. Okay, so I got a big piece and I'm just gonna cut it. Cut the foam. Like this. See? Then I'm just gonna squeeze some paint down there. Like that. I'm gonna grab my Q tip or uh, Or my yeah, cotton ball. I'm gonna use my Q-tip. Just dab it in there, and then just dot and oh, I'm gonna do this on top of some paper, just to be safe. I'm just gonna use my cotton ball to speed it up a bit. And this will give it a little bit of a texture too. But you can use a regular uh, paintbrush if you want. I like the texture so far. If you use just the cotton ball, I'll warn you, it is kind of messy. And it should be able to dry pretty fast. But if you have a little difficulty, then you can just uh, use a blow dryer. Okay, so now that it is that is done. I'm gonna do just a teeny bit more to cover up some of the spots that are still a little white. Like right here. Okay, so see? There you go. Yeah, like I said, it dries pretty fast. So, I squeezed away too much. But I still have that much left. Well, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do the uh, bottle cap, so I'm gonna use my, uh, so let me move this aside, one sec, let me move that aside on a different piece of paper. Thank you. So all the ones drying, you can... I'm going to show you how to do the bottle cap one. Okay, so let's see. Just get some paint and just. It doesn't have to be perfect. Oops. Let's see, 
say this is built a little pit. This is fun. Okay. <laughs> yes. Oh no, I'm just gonna use my combo again. Whoop. And done. So that's the fast one. That's one way. So one sec, let me wash my hands real quick. So I've washed my hands, and I am going to blow dry the ones. I'm gonna blow dry them. You can throw this one away. Okay. So. for today. Uh, okay. So now I'm gonna put it right little mile. in this part so it is pretty flat. Okay, so use that. Right. What am I going to use this for? Um, I forgot to mention this you only need some packaging tape. Yeah, just grab the packaging tape. Let me hold it again. <laughs> okay, found it. The part. Okay. So then, just roll it like that, and 
so it will fit the size. Oops. Oh god. I guess I have to be taking a shower today. Because the things can not move on me. See, that's how you make that little mirror. That big mirror, I should say. Uh -oh. And then I grab this. And then I'm just going to cut out a very small square shape. Like that. And then I'm just going to set it in that little one. Something like that. Uh, you can like make it so it will fit in there and as you can see you can kind of see in it a little bit but yeah bye